Hi guys, Kai here and welcome back. This is episode 71 of the FIFA 17 My Player Career and we're going to cover about four games in today's episode and the first one being a home tie against Sheffield Wednesday. This is a Premier League game. It's been a while since Sheffield Wednesday have been in the Premier League. Back when I was a youngster, they used to be a regular in the Premiership, but now uh, not so much. So let's see how they get on today against the Arsenal at the Emirates Stadium. In fact, I believe this is Sheffield Wednesday's first game at the Emirates. Let's see how they get on. Hopefully, it, it's going to be an easy three points here for the Arsenal as we push forward early on. And Sheffield Wednesday do well there to get the ball clear. So, still 0-0. Approaching 20 minutes played in this Premier League game. And it is Sheffield Wednesday currently in possession. Passing dangerously at the back. And they've given it away there. It is Francis Cochrane with the interception who tries to play it through for Kai. Kai steals it off the defender like he normally likes to do. Cuts inside, nice little bit of skill. Tees it up for Cazola, but Cazola couldn't get it on target. And that shot goes just over the crossbar. But a good chance there for Arsenal to take lead. And we're going to jump straight into the second half now. 25 minutes to play here at the Emirates Stadium. It's still Arsenal nil, Sheffield Wednesday nil. That's a nice little through ball, but Kai unlucky there. Just get Budges off the ball. And he's stolen it off the defender though. And he puts it away. From out in there where Arsenal are in front. Poor defending there from Sheffield Wednesday. Originally Kyle was budged off the ball but then he stole the ball back off the other defender and took advantage and slides it away into the back of the net to give Arsenal a one goal lead. Look at this, he likes to do this pretty often. Defenders are so poor in this game in career mode but there we go, nice finish for Kai. How many is that now for the season? That is Kai's. Oh, we're not even going to find out the... The thing didn't play out, so we will find out in this episode, though, how many games he has got so far in the season. Here he is now, pushing forward, trying to double Arsenal's lead. If he can play the through ball, no, he's going all the way himself. He waits for the run of Granite Xhaka. Granite Xhaka uh, passes it out to Rafa. Rafa pulls it back towards Kai. Kai shoots, and that is his second of the game. There we go. That's going to wrap up the three points as well for the Gunners. Good play there from Arsenal. Well played from Rafa. He was patient, he pulled the ball back to Kai and then Kai with a nice bit of control and a nice finish to give Arsenal a two goal lead, 83 minutes gone and then there we go, that is Kai's fifth Premier League goal of the season, remember it is still early on in the season so we're looking to score more, yeah, I don't know what kind of tally we should go for towards the end of the season, yeah, maybe 20 goals minimum um, we should get Kai. Yeah, Cochrane was just offside there so it is going to be a free kick here for Sheffield Wednesday this is probably going to end the game unless we can push forward and steal a third no we cannot the final whistle blows a nice victory there for Arsenal it took a while to get the first goal but then we got the second as well and Kai getting them both finishing the game on a 9.5 rating which is a pretty decent start to today's episode so next up then for Arsenal, another game at the Emirates Stadium, the second home game in a row. This time it is in the Europa League where we take on Lyon, Olympic Lyon that is, from France. Let's see how this one goes. We're doing pretty well so far in the Europa League, which is only to be expected in all honesty. We should be playing in the Champions League, but unfortunately Arsenal didn't qualify uh, last season. Hopefully we can do that this season though, and of course we want to be the Premier League champions come the end of the end of the season and we're looking pretty good for that so far we are battling at the top of the table currently top I believe and so hopefully that can continue try and build a gap as well here we go 25 minutes gone Arsenal on the attack here's Rafa He's got quite a few assists already this season El Nene plays it forward for Kai Kai just loses out there poor pass from him and now El Nene was also Going to go for that interception, but it's actually Kai. Now Arsenal on the attack. Here is Oxley chamberlain with the shot. Wrong side of the post. And look there. Well, good, decent chance for Arsenal. Should be 1-0 in front. And we're into the final 20 minutes here at the Emirates Stadium. It's still goalless. And is there going to be a goal from either side? Here's Meza Ozil. Plays it onto his near side for Kai. Arsene Wenger has told the players to go on an all-out attack. And that's what they're doing right now. Oxley chamberlain with a nice turn and a nice finish. Finally, the deadlock has been broken. No shots at all from Leon. That's a bit of a surprise, but that is the sixth shot of the game for Arsenal. And that one is going to count. It's going to be Arsenal 1, Leon 0. And will that be the winning goal? Good play there from Chamberlain. It's a nice little turn and a nice finish to score his first Europa League goal of the season. And I'm sure there'll be more to come from him as well. And here he is in possession as we approach the final minute of this game. Can we push for a second? Rafa looking to get the cross in and Chamberlain's there to get the ball back in but there 
is the Leon keeper and he's going to get this one upfield and that's probably going to be the last action of the game or is it? Yes it is because there is the final whistle so a nice win there for Arsenal. Took a while again to get that first goal but eventually it came by Oxley chamberlain and giving us a nice 1-0 win. So now that Europa League is done for now we are back in the Premier League where we face Stoke City. This is going to be a tough one. It is away from home. Stoke is always a tough place to go and look at the kit. The kit is a little bit glitched out there. That would be pretty funny if we actually you know, played in that kit. But unfortunately, I don't think it's going to work. And as you can see there, we are top of the Premier League table. And we are the only unbeaten side so far this season. Hopefully that can continue. Remember, we did try and do that when we was in the Premier League last time with Liverpool. You know, but unfortunately, we did lose one game. And we want to go one better this time and go unbeaten and be the new Arsenal Invincibles if we can. We did try to be unbeaten with Barcelona, but that didn't quite work work out either. So let's see what we can do here at Emirates Stadium, or at least at Arsenal. Playing in our all-yellow kit. A good chance early on here. Mesut Ozil could have probably ran through himself there. He had a nice little ball delivered from Kai. And we're still in the attack. Still 0-0 though. Chamberlain does keep possession for Arsenal. Here's Kai. Plays it onto his near side, finds his man Gibbs. Gibbs plays it inside for Kai. Kai plays a nice little through ball. It wasn't made for Cochrane, but he's been taken down by Ryan Shawcross. And Arsenal are going to have a chance to go in front here. Just over 20 minutes played. That ball originally from Kai wasn't meant for Cochrane, but he took it on and then he got taken down. And Shawcross does get a yellow card. So it's going to be a penalty kick here for Arsenal. And it is going to be the man Kai who steps up to take it. It's going to go left. Goalkeeper goes the wrong way. And there we go. A fairly early goal. Earlier than the other games that we've got so far. And Stoke nil, Arsenal won. Just over 20 minutes gone. And we are looking good in the glorious sunshine here at the Britannia Stadium. Let's try and get some more. As I said, Stoke City is always a tough place to play. Especially away from home. And... Six goals in the Premier League so far for Kai. Looking for his seventh. Can he get it in this game? Here's Oxley chamberlain playing it more centrally. Cockland, nice little one-twos there with Aaron Ramsey. Aaron Ramsey decides to give it to Gibbs, but Cockland again on the ball. Kai's in some space. Gibbs finds him. Ozil, nice bit of skill. Can he play it through? There he goes for the shot. Force and the save there from Jack Butland. And a good save indeed from the Stoke City goalkeeper. And he could have possibly played that through there, Meza Ozil, to find Kai, who was running straight through in the middle, but he decided to go with a shot. Uh, I don't really blame him, to be honest. 8.2 rated so far for Kai, and that corner was poor. It's going to go out for another one. And now played still Stoke City 1, uh, Stoke City 0, sorry, Arsenal 1. And we are looking good for the three points, and we're not conceded in a while, which is pretty decent. The goalkeeper must be loving it, the defenders too. But it is Stoke City on the attack. Unfortunately, they've just lost it. And now Kai is through on goal. Is he going to go all the way here? He shoots. Oh, straight at the keeper. Should have done a low-driven shot across the keeper. And that one probably could have gone into the back of the net. And it is a corner. And again, another poor corner here from Arsenal. Cleared away. Can he get this ball back in? Come on, Ozil. Ozil does get the cross in. But again, Stoke City defending well and thumping the ball upfield. So it's still 1-0 to Arsenal. Can't get past the defence or the goalkeeper. Butland, of course. Here's OP in FIFA 17. And the counter-attack is on here for Arsenal. Here is Aaron Ramsey. Kai's there in the middle. Is he going to play him in? He does. Kai controls it. Oh, not enough on it. Not enough on it. Unlucky there. A good chance for Arsenal to double the lead. But it looks like this one is going to be another 1-0 win. And there is the final whistle. Good chance there at the end, but never mind. We still get the three points away from home. 8.3 final match rated for Kai. One goal, no assists, uh, but never mind. And we're going to jump straight into the fourth and final game in today's episode. And this one is at home back at the Emirates Stadium where we face Southampton. Again, Southampton are a good team, even though Arsenal did beat them yesterday in the FA Cup 5-0. In real life, that is. Let's see if we can match that performance today. We are at the Emirates Stadium and it is Southampton who get this game started. They are playing in their black and grey away strip. Arsenal, of course, playing in their red and white. And we're on the attack. No, that was a poor ball. I was going to say it was only a good attack there, but the the ball was poor. Seamus Coleman playing it inside for Kai. Now oh, Nene looking for the space and Arsenal are moving into space. Cockland plays it straight through here for Kai. Nice little bit of skill from him. He tees up Santi Cazorla who hits it low into the near post. And that is the first goal of the game. The perfect start for Arsenal. 
just over 10 minutes gone it is Arsenal 1 Southampton 0 and again we are looking good for another victory here we are really in form right now we're on fire in fact Santa Cazorla and Kai Link not well and he is the captain as well so that is Cazorla's first Premier League goal of the season sure there will be more, many more to come from him can we get a second here? It's Rob Holding plays it forward for Gibbs. Just over half an hour gone. Oh, back heel there tried from El Nene, I believe it was. Unfortunately, goes straight into the defender's feet. And Southampton playing straight through the middle now. Classy. Oh, he's just lost out. Good defending there from Kieran Gibbs. Now Kite holding up play. Well played. Finds Miles. Cazola back through for Nathan Miles. And he's put it in. There we go, Maitland-Niles scores the second Arsenal goal of the game. Ten minutes to go in this first half. And it's always nice to see the youngsters scoring. And I guess he's not too young now, because uh, we've played quite a few seasons in this career. And so it is Maitland-Niles who scores Arsenal's second. That gives us a two-goal lead, and that should really wrap up the three points here at the Emirates Stadium. That's his first Premier League goal of the season. It could be his first Arsenal goal in, in all competitions, actually. Yeah, I'm not entirely sure of his stats. And we're into the final minute now here, and we're looking for a third. And Chambers plays the ball inside for Kai. The bounce favours Kai, and he manages to get ahead on it, and he puts it just over the outreaching goalkeeper to give Arsenal a three-goal lead in the final minute of the game, and that will wrap up the match as well. Look at that, a nice little bounce there. Favoured Kai. And how many is that for the season now for him? That's his seventh Premier League goal of the season. A great performance yet again from the Gunners. Now we just wait for that final whistle to blow. It will secure us at the top of the table for now at least. And we want to start building a gap here as I mentioned. Come on ref, blow that whistle. There we go. A nice 3-0 victory for Arsenal. And another three points in the bag for the team in form.